We're talking about knowledge of the future in movies. In this clip, I'll cover actress Diane Franklin. She's known for her roles in such movies as Amityville 2, The Possession, 1982. She was Princess Joanna in Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure, 1989. And also in Better Off Dead with John Cusack, 1985. So I took a look at Diane Franklin. And I believe she may resemble actors Mark L. Taylor and possibly actress Jessica Lange. These two were together in an episode of the FX television series Feud. Episode title is Abandoned, air date April 16, 2017. And also in this were actresses Susan Sarandon, actor Alfred Molina, Stanley Tucci, and Kathy Bates. All right, connections. Both Diane Franklin and Mark L. Taylor, they were an separate episodes of the television comedy Charles in Charge. Franklin's episode was A Date from Heck, 1987. And Mark Taylor was in the episode Yesterday Cafe in 1989. Both Taylor and Franklin they were also in separate episodes of Alfred Hitchcock Presents. Mark Taylor was in a 1985 episode, and Diane Franklin was also in a 1985 episode. I think a major clue uh, that backs up this possible resemblance, look at the third movie in the Amityville series, Amityville 3D in 1983. So in this movie, you will find actress Meg Ryan, who was in the movie Inner Space in 1987 with actor Dennis Quaid. And yes, Mark L. Taylor is also cast in this movie. My YouTube channel is Easter Egg Psychic. There I go back and look at movies and television from the past. I analyze these for possible references to future media. These may appear in the form of anecdotes, idioms, anagrams, hidden in the subtext of the work in question. I also use an unconventional method where I look at the likenesses of the actors. And what I found is you can take the likenesses, match these up to some of the anecdotal items, and show past, present, and future information about actors and other personalities or may resemble the personalities in the movie or television episode that you're watching. My email contact is Easter Egg Guy, that's G U Y, at yahoo.com. Yes, I do accept Bitcoin donations. I'll put my Bitcoin wallet on screen. All you have to do is scan this. You can send as much Bitcoin as you like if you know how to use Bitcoin. And any contributions are greatly appreciated. Thanks for watching.